Hello guys welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video we will see how to fix Samsung Galaxy Watch 7 screen flickering. So without wasting your time let's get started. So the step 1 is restart the watch. Sometimes a simple restart can resolve many software glitches issue. So you can simply press and hold the power button and the bottom button together until you see a Samsung logo on the screen. Okay? So once you see a Samsung logo, you can simply leave it as it is. It will take 2 to 3 minutes to restart the watch. Step 2. Check for software update. Sometimes a outdated software can cause many software glitches issue. So you can simply check the software update if available. So you can simply go to settings, then software update and then tap or download and install. Here it will find a, any software update is available or not. If available, you can simply download them. If not, you will see on my screen, my watch is up to date. So in this case, you can simply move to our next steps. So our next step is disable adaptive brightness. So you can simply open your watch and then go to settings and then go to display. Okay, because sometimes uh, adaptive brightness can cause a flickering issue. Okay, so then you can simply here find our adaptive brightness feature. You can simply turn this feature off. Also, you will see here a always on display. So you can also disable a always on display mode. Okay. So the next step is factory reset the watch. So if all the above steps are failed, so it's time to reset the watch. So to reset, you can simply go to settings and then go to general. Okay. And here, scroll down and then tap on reset so before resetting it will ask you to reset your all mobile plans okay after that click on next and then now they will ask you to back up your all important data because in adapt if in factory reset your all important data will be permanently removed okay so you can simple after that tap on reset to reset the watch so if a reset is cannot resolve your issue, so it's time to contact a customer support for further assistance. They can provide additional troubleshooting steps or help will repair if necessary. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more tech tips and tutorial. Goodbye.